everyone, so today I'm going to change my nose piercing for the first time. So I've never taken it out before and today I'm finally going to do that. I'm so excited about it because I really don't like this thing that I have going on right now. Uh, but yeah, the piercer actually said that I could already change it after like six to eight weeks. But a lot of people said they would get piercing bumps when they do that. So I didn't want to risk it and just wait it for months. But today I'm finally going to change it. I'm going to change this to this little hoop right here. I just got this from a piercing shop and a piercer said that it should fit. So yeah, we're going to try it out today. So I already cleaned everything. I cleaned my hands, cleaned the piercing area and cleaned the other piercing. So now I'm just going to put my finger in my nose. I know very attractive and try to get this ball loose. Okay guys, so at first I thought that unscrewing the ball was going easy, but no, it was a complete nightmare. It did not want to come off, but right now I finally got it off, but it got dark outside. So I'm using uh, lights in my room and everything, so the lighting might not be the best. I really have to get some proper lighting soon because in the winter time filming is just horror because um, before you know it, it's dark. And uh, yeah, I took my septum down because it's normally in my nose, because I thought it would make a little bit of a difference maybe with unscrewing the ball, but yeah, as you can see, the ball is off now. So now I can finally put this little ring in. It's one of those click rings. So I opened it right now. It's really hard to show you because it's so small, but, uh, and it's also shiny. But yeah, I hope you can see that. Now I'm basically just going to put it in and I'm not going to take this one out, but I'm just going to push it back a little because I think it's going to be difficult to find the hole when it's out, if you know what I mean. So I'm going to kind of thread it through. I hope this will go smoothly. Concentration. Sorry, this stuff is so not going to plan. I had to do this off camera because I wanted to be really careful. But it's finally in now and I wish my camera would focus a little bit better. But as you can see, my nose is quite red now because it was quite difficult, but I just put it in from the inside. I just put the old jewelry back in that went really easily um, because, you know, it's straight. And then I took it out like a little so that it won't really stick out in the inside, if you know what I mean. So that it would still be in the hole, but like halfway. And then I put the um, nose ring in from the inside and then slowly pushed it and then this fell out and then it was finally in. So now all I have to do is close it. So this is what it looks like from up close. It's open still, so we're going to close it. This is what the piercing looks like right now. I don't know, I feel like it's a little bit too big. The piercing lady said that this would be my size, but um, clearly it isn't really. I mean, it sticks out. A little bit too much but yeah I guess it's okay I'm just gonna leave it in right now because this took me way too much time to put in and everything like that so yeah um so this was pretty much the video for today I hope you guys kind of like it and um yeah thank you so much for watching and I'll hopefully see you later in my next video have a nice day bye <laughs>